Uh, so I'll give you a very quick synopsis of Kindred Spirits. Kindred Spirits explores the lives and work of two very accomplished but unsung Black women artists and their special bond as aunt and niece. Throughout this exploration of their art and careers, a third port portrait emerges, and that is of a segregated Washington, D.C., where denied the same access and opportunities as their white colleagues, Black artists seized educational opportunities, they became prominent faculty members at African American schools, and they established their own venues to exhibit and publish their work. Uh, Kindred Spirits uh, premiered on PBS uh, last February in celebration of Black History Month. And so it's uh, it was broadcast on PBS member stations throughout the country. It's currently streaming on PBS. Right now it's only for PBS Passport members. That means that you have to be a member of your local PBS station to watch it. But the great news is that in starting February 1st for the entire month of February, in celebration of Black History Month, you can watch uh, the entire documentary for free. And if you'd like, you can share it with your students also. Um, so um, Vanessa, who is our wonderful tech coordinator for this session uh, with, um, with Teaching for Change, she is going to drop that link in there so that um, you can watch it. If, if for any reason you miss the link, you can just Google Kindred Spirits uh, plus PBS and, and you'll get the link. If you're a member of your local PBS station, you can, you can watch it starting anytime you'd like. Um, also, she'll be dropping in the link for the website for the film, which is kindredspiritsfilm.com. We've had really wonderful screenings of the film in film festivals, as I mentioned on PBS, um, at museums, at conferences. And, um, and actually the very first screening took place at the Avalon Theater, which is a historic theater in Washington, DC. And it was in partnership with an organization in Washington, DC called the DC Arts and Humanities Education Collaborative. And we invited uh, high school students and their teachers to come and watch the film. And uh, that was right before everything shut down, right before COVID had everything shut down. So that was a really nice screening. Uh, the students really enjoyed it and we got really positive evaluations um, of the film and the discussion afterwards. So we had a really nice discussion with the students. What I'd like to do first is show you a clip of the film so you get a, a sense of the two artists who are featured in the film. And then after that, uh, I'd like to share with you the study guide, which I've developed, and then love to get your, your feedback on it. So, um, so we're gonna uh, start um, playing the, the film first and we'll watch the first 10 minutes and then we'll come back. <laughs> 